What's going on everybody? Welcome back to G Maya's World and many of you guys have been asking about the Blitz promo so we're going to go ahead and take a look at what's going on. I know you guys can see right there that I have 820 Blitz Bolts. Um, pretty much when I did the actual challenges uh, for what we had to go through to get, um, what was that, that turkey stuff, the turkey trophy or whatever, you were able to get like a jump start with the Blitz Bolt. So I'm going to show you guys what's been going on with that. Uh, pretty much right in here in the turkey bowl right here you get a head start on the blitz promo by earning blitz bolt currency now obviously 820 bolts ain't gonna do anything ea sports is gonna make bank because they're gonna release super fast players we might get a chris johnson it's gonna be probably a tyreek hill people that are super fast are gonna be out i don't know if they would probably on that friday release randy moss to kind of make their money just go out of the roof because look pretty much what's gonna happen is many of us are going to actually spend money during the blitz promo because that's a time where you usually get your team up in different aspects. Now, full details about how they're going to be dropping the promo has not yet been released. And some of you guys are very concerned with the fact that it looks like EA Sports is focusing more on the next gen than this current gen that we're in right now. But I'm going to tell you guys right now, rest assured, I believe that both consoles, like PS4 to PS5, Xbox One to Xbox X, all of them are going to get similar content. Because remember, they've already told us that everything is transferable. So they're going to have to keep a level playing field on both consoles. I believe that's the way they did it for Madden 25 as well. Everything was pretty much the same because you can't do anything outside of it because it's the same game dropping the same year on different consoles. So it's going to be the same content, in my opinion. If they do it differently, that's going to be kind of weird because it's supposed to be transferable as long as you're on the same, um, you know, same company. If you're with Sony, you're with Sony. If you're with Microsoft, you're with Microsoft regardless of the system because you can actually start Weekend League in one game, in one system, and it'll lock on that system, but it'll register on both, act you know, both consoles. You know, they've already talked about, like, you know, pretty much the whole situation of how it's going to be transferable and the upgradable version of the game. So based on the information that we've been given, it seems like it's going to be a level playing field but it's going to be on you know the pretty much the parent company situation so you can't mix and match through the company you can't go sony to microsoft microsoft to sony you got to stay with the same thing but it should be similar content so for those of you guys that are scared about that don't worry about it. that's pretty much what they've been saying on good morning madden so i believe that that's the way it's going to be so this blitz promo um and everything that comes with it it should easily be transferable to your new console basically what i was, is what i need to tell you guys because you guys have been asking about that situation now let's get to the fact that many of you guys are wondering what cards what's going on what should you be investing in well pretty much right now i just invested a lot into my offensive line so i'm dead broke right so right now i can do different things i can actually use uh the cards that i got from completing the night train lane set and get some cornucopia packs and do things like that i don't know if right now that's the right move to do but based on some of the things that you guys have been saying you've been getting out of cornucopia packs maybe that might be the move now if we wait it's no guarantee that fallen leaves is going to be able to do anything like miraculous but based on what's available in the store right now i don't think let me let me just go back and check the store real quick i don't think that uh any of the limiteds are still in packs um the shaquille griffin or anything like that i don't believe but this guy is still in packs right now and it, it says it ends at 10 a.m., but nobody really wants the Drew Brees anyway. Um, as a matter of fact, like if I got him, he's getting rage sold immediately or going for training. But inside of the store with the cornucopia packs, those are just some of the things that you can possibly do right now as we wait. But the head start by playing those challenges are going to be important. Like I said before, the Blitz Bolts currency is going to be what it's all about, which is why I'm very, very inclined to go ahead and do this now for you guys. I wanted to save it. Um, with everything that was available because I think they all quick sell for like 15,000 so we're gonna go over here we're gonna go to uh, the newest and we're gonna find um, all the other cards that we got so night train we don't want Von Miller we don't want Aaron Jones we don't want Austin Hooper we don't want this guy so they all quick sell for 15,000 fallen leaves all right let's just make sure we are doing the right cards yeah because you know what I'm saying bro you don't want to have night train in there by mistake but he's not available so we're good all right so look 15,000 fallen leaves all right we're gonna go now and go ahead and get rid of it. Because like I said, the Blitz Bolts currency, more than likely, you're gonna be spending something. If it's $20, 50, whatever, because there's going to be a player that you're gonna like. Now, before I spend the coins, uh, I mean, before I spend the currency, the Fallen Leaves, I want you guys to take a look at this real quick. Because Tyreek Hill's price is very, very low. More than likely, they've, we've been waiting for it. 
and Tyreek has had decent games. But you got to remember, with the way that the game is set up, they have to have a certain schedule on when cards can be released. So you got to be careful with that. Yesterday, he was low, as low as 28K. So he's starting to raise up a little bit. Uh, people are realizing that these things are going to happen. Now, there's no guarantee um, that it will happen. But a lot of you guys that got him in the 20K range, you're probably going to come up very, very huge. Because more than likely, I don't know if they'll give him 99 speed. I think they're waiting for Randy Moss to give Randy Moss 99 speed, but he'll be very, very close to that. Or he may just be 99 speed and be undersized at 510. Like that could be something that gets done. So it is something that I would probably let you guys be aware of like every year, just to kind of help you guys with a come up. If you could get some of those guys, um, any other player you could think of, but more than likely the master is gonna be a player that's not yet in the game. Like I brought up Chris Johnson because he's a guy that always comes to mind. Uh, during the blitz promo uh, that may be available so it was just something that you know I think you guys should be aware of um, you're gonna have to probably figure out ways to get more blitz bolts and one of those major ways is gonna be like the sales that they're gonna have with the you know the blitz sales and all that kind of foolishness and then you come in at a certain time you're trying to eat dinner with your family and they're like yo look eight o'clock be right here EA Sports like what but that's what EA Sports does they're a beautiful company when it comes to spending time with your family so we're gonna go right here we're gonna open up this cornucopia pack and we're gonna see what's going on in this all right so what is this so they're giving us julian edelman that dude's garbage all right cool so now that's one all right but remember when you go to go do this it contains 189 plus player from the 50 oil and blast team of the week legends most fed redux standouts heavyweights so there's opportunities for a lot of stuff all right don't be scared about that that julian edelman is gonna get raped so instantaneous what is this what is that Yo, they give okay. They're giving out straight garbage. I, I've never seen that that opening right there. I've never actually seen that. So that was kind of that was kind of nice to see that. Uh, it's all trash though. But yeah, it was kind of nice to see it. Okay, what's this? Oh, we got bats. We got bats. All right, a 90 Travis Kelsey. All right, so pretty much all garbage. So what that pretty much means is we're gonna have to find another means to make some currency. It's not that big of a deal. We'll go ahead and finish out the rest of these fallen leaves uh, with the 80 plus overall players. There's nothing else that we can really do with it. Again, I wanna go ahead and point out to you guys that the major reason of doing all this is just to be prepared for what's coming soon. You don't wanna get caught when, you know, just chilling out, waiting like, all right, uh, the Blitz promo is coming. I got so many fallen leaves. It may benefit you or it may not, but I don't think that EA is gonna have a situation where it's like okay we're gonna focus more on autumn you know on fallen leaves with autumn blast when blitz makes them so much money remember it's about making money guys so with everything that's going on within the game i just feel that it was you know i wanted to show you guys that i'm utilizing my fallen leaves you can hold them because you might pull something better out of that cornucopia pack later than i will you see what I'm saying? But, but that's just the way my pack luck is. It doesn't really matter. I just wanted to get rid of them because I've been investing in different aspects of the game. So now, remember like what I told you guys before, I invested in one Tyreek Hill. You know why I did that? Just so that you know, I could say, look, I got one. I'm not a psycho like you guys. I'm not trying to fill my whole binder with him. I'm not doing that because what happens is, you know, right now with the way everything is and how the market is, if I do that and he only engage like, you know, 510, let me see how much these guys are going for though. Hold up, what is that? Let me see, much, okay, 15, 30, no, nah, it don't really matter. We'll hold on to them for a little bit, but I don't want to really focus on the wrong things because what happens is if I keep playing around with that and just holding the fallen leaves and then everything converts to like major blitz bolts, everything like that, which is what they usually do because they're gonna be having all kinds of like immediate plans and um, like certain set things in the store and you just wanna have as much currency as possible right you want to have as many coins as possible and then you're going to probably need uh need to utilize blitz bolts they may release other um you know challenges and stuff like that i'll keep you guys updated with that but these guys like i said you go through it you find out what's going on i have one tyree kill guys you know i can't do it like you got yo i'm telling you dudes have sent me snapshots where they had a full binder of tyree kills i'm like all right cool because you're gonna probably still make something if you got them for dirt cheap but again he is undersized and if EA is smart and they give us a 50 player like Randy Moss on Black Friday or something like that, it's going to really trump him. Or it might enhance it because there might be 299 receivers running around now. You know what I'm saying? But defensively, I think we're all set with that. We have the proper zone. We have the proper players out there. So I think we'll be set either way. It's still going to be balanced regardless. But I just wanted to make sure that you guys were up to date with the information that I have right now. So that way everybody knows what's going on. Because that's what I want to make sure of is that you guys are fully prepared and ready to go. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember guys, we have the apparel on the channel now. If you guys wanna look fly in a G Myers World t-shirt, you wanna wear that mask, let me know about it in the comments. Look under the video. Take care of yourselves and family, be safe. I'm gonna see you guys and girls next time. One love, y'all.